Just a quick overview on the uh, EMIMS and EMBRA. Uh, basically, we're gonna find it on the program sometime. We're gonna explain the type of exercises and timing to rest and perform the movements into EMIMS or EMBRAPs. Now, I'll start with the EMBRAP, that's the easier to understand. It breaks down into as many rounds as possible. So for instance, if we're going to do a couple of exercises, let's say uh, ten push-up, ten push-ups, um, ten goblet squat, squat, and let's say ten calories and ski egg. Right? So in these positions we have an MRAP. Normally we're gonna go for an MRAP time. So you're gonna set up a time for that. Normally it's a MRAP, let's say eight minutes. So you're gonna perform as many rounds as possible or these three movements resting just as much as you need for eight minutes total. Now the goal is to perform um, as more rounds as possible through the month so if every week you're going to have the same MRAP setup and this month you set up for two um, for the first session two rounds let's say and 10 push-ups uh, next week you're going to have at least uh, two rounds and get into five goblet squat or ten goblet squat so uh, by improving the rounds we improve the work capacity now this is very simple to get it the next one up is the imams and the imam stands for every minute on the minute. There is different way to set that up. Mostly we're gonna find it in this position. We're gonna set up an example for that. For instance, it could be um, imam uh, 10. So we're gonna go for a total amount of 10 minutes. And we can set it up for, for instance, two movements. And we're gonna do, let's say, A and B. On the A, that will be in the uh, odd minutes. We want to work, let's say, in the push up, as we said before. We're going to do 10 push ups. And in B, we're going to work on, let's say, uh, max hold or plank. Basically, what happened here in the first minute with a running clock, you're going to perform 10 push ups and you're going to rest the rest of the minutes. In the second minute, as soon as the minute starts, we're gonna hold our plank, we're gonna try to hold it for as long as possible. We're gonna rest every single minute only when we complete the task. For instance, if we go 10, we're gonna have, for instance, 35 seconds left, we're gonna rest the 35 seconds. We're gonna increase the volume to that up to 10, and uh, we're basically increasing the exercise normally start a little bit easier the first two three rounds they, they'll feel pretty good and then we start fatiguing and then start getting harder now an example of uh, the second uh, uh, imam type as you find it here you can see the main difference here is the twos in the middle and basically what he says is the same that every second minute on the second minutes so if you're running the clock Basically, we're going to set up, for instance, a running clock for two minutes and we're going to perform, let's say, two exercises, so A1, A2, that means that we're going to do it in the same two minutes block and we're going to perform, let's say, our 10 push-ups and 10 pull-ups. And the same idea, instead of resting up to one minute, we're going to rest up to two minutes. In case you set up uh, two different uh, exercises that require more rest or are uh, much higher in repetition, we can set up an A and B. So that means that we want to work on two minutes there and two minutes there. For instance, you're going to have uh, here maybe back squat, um, back squat on. So we want to work on A reps and that requires a lot of more rest. And here we want to do, for instance, uh, uh, RDOs and then there we're going to rest the rest of the second minutes. Now, moving from there, we're going into the imam with the three or four minutes. A little bit more red at a setup, but it does help us uh, uh, giving a very good understanding of how much we should rest. So sometimes we might set up the three, four or five minutes. So if you're going to have a three and or three M, that means I want you to rest at least two minutes uh, two minutes and a half. So in this case, if we set up, for instance, uh, um, let's say above a deadlift, we're gonna perform, for instance, three reps. And these might be a very high intensity, so we work on 
of one uh, RM. So let's say quite heavy. So I want you to rest the rest of the time. So we're gonna perform the three reps and then literally gonna completely rest. And we're gonna rest the, the two and a half to two minutes and 40 seconds left. This is pretty much the setup. You might find in, uh, in different exercises and different uh, work, uh, workouts. So this is the main set. If you have a question, just text me during the workout. Otherwise, this is the standard set for that.